It has been understood that how protective a man will be is related to the size of his trapezius muscle. It is known that the triangular-shaped trapezius, which starts from the base of the neck, is the most superficial back muscle. In the research conducted by the University of Arkansas in the USA, 305 people were asked to look at four computer-generated pictures of the same person. People who saw pictures in which the trapezius muscle was larger evaluated the man as a better protector for his children. Experts said that a man's neck is an indicator of physical strength. The research was conducted by doctor from the University of Arkansas in the USA. It contains interesting findings that emerged as a result of a study conducted by Brown and his team. As part of the study, 305 participants were asked to examine four different computer-generated images of the same man. Although the neck muscles of the men in the pictures were of different sizes, everything was the same in the other pictures. Participants were asked to rate the man in the pictures on a variety of characteristics, including his ability to protect and nurture his children. The pictures were shown in a random order, and the participants were not told beforehand how many pictures of different people they would see, thus preventing them from understanding the purpose of the study. When men had larger neck muscles, they were rated, on average, as better able to protect their children. But on the other hand, it was thought that with her muscles in this area less developed, she would be less able to care for her children. Dr. We evolved evolutionarily to have an effective way to determine a man's physical strength, Brown said. For our ancestors, it was important to quickly understand whether someone was strong or not because they had the potential to harm us, and the neck was used as a more reliable and quicker clue than the face than the body. Considering size provides a nice balance when immediacy of facial perception and accuracy of body perception are important, says Dr. Brown described himself as an evolutionary psychologist with a big neck. This assessment of physical strength then translates into a perception of whether a man will be more protective of children or more nurturing. Dr. Another group of neck muscles, the sternocleidomastoids, were also manipulated in Brown's experiments, but this did not affect people's perceptions of men's ability to be fathers. Following another study published in 2020, it was found that men with a dad body were generally perceived as better fathers than those with a more muscular physique. Researchers from the University of Southern Mississippi found that fathers who carried slightly more weight were perceived as less dominant, and therefore warmer and more attached.